hey, is there any topic in any subject which is becoming too heavy for you to understand? Well, guess what? Vedantu got your back. We have curated some amazing subject-wise, topic-wise micro courses which will help you to clear all the concepts in a fun, interactive way. And guess what? They are available at some mind-blowing price. So do check them out. Hey guys, this is your captain. I'm back again on this part two of Hoffman Bromide Reaction. Yesterday, we have seen the concept, the mechanism, and yes, some JE information about Hoffman Bromide Reaction. Now we are going to put it to use, right? We have learned the you know, mechanism, we have understood the concept. Now we are going to apply it. Ki is pe questions kaise kiye jai. Let's hop into it, beta. Let's hop into it without wasting any time. Let's start. Okay, example number one. Let me get this, you know, thing working. Yes, all right. But it's such a savala, they can have a mazaga. They go, Pella saval, but I basic, but I normal, the other hand in a man, a Kalbi Samjayata. Whenever you will see this reagent, BR2KOH, TK, to Kya Samajane. Sometimes it is also written beta KOBR. Confuse Nayuna. It is also an indicative that this is Hoffman bromide reaction. It is also an indicative that this is Hoffman bromide reaction. So, beta, kya kam karna hai aapko? Remove C double bond O, put NH2 right next to methyl group. This will become ME. NH2, pehli cheez, done. Dousra question, aaj ye dousra question pe, dousra sawal. Yaan pe ethyl group lag gaya hai, doesn't matter. BR2KOH hai, C double bond ho, just remove, put NH2 right next to ethyl group. Mujhe to maza aara hai yaar. I hope you guys are understanding, kitne saral sawal hai, free ke paise hai, free ke marks hai, actually, paisa bhol gaya, marks hai ye to, thik hai? Aage badhte hai, moving on. Uh, tertiary butyl. Tertiary butyl group laga hai. doesn't matter, kuchu se farak nahi hai, bada hi piyara hai, koi bhed bhav nahi hai, jaldi se karo, tertiary butyl, what will be the answer, yaha pe lag jayega NH2. Did I tell you the khasiyat, the importance of this reaction, that it will give you pure primary amine, without any kind of impurity, this is the only way to go about it, if you want pure primary amine, go for Hoffman bromide reaction, koi impurity kisi dousre amine ki aati hi nahi hai, thik hai ji, bhoot badiya. Alright, to ab aagya fourth question, this question is very heavy, thik hai? We will use the application what we have done uh, yesterday. I have taught you that by chance if this R group or this alkyl group is chiral, then it will shift in such a manner that the you know the if it is R or if it is S, the configuration will not shift. And I told you that this Wolff rearrangement is so simultaneous and cons. Uh, concerted, so simultaneous and so cons concerted, there will not be any opportunity for the alkyl group, if chiral, for any kind of flipping. Wo availability nahi hoga. So, yaad rakhiye beta, ab yahan pe zara dhyan dete hai. This is one priority, this is two priority, this is three priority, this is fourth priority. So, ye kuch aisa karke, this will be R, I hope ye sabko samaj aagya hoga. So, this particular alkyl group will remain R in configuration only. What you guys have to do, remove C double bond O. Yahan par aapko kya mil jayega? Check out this. Isko R hi aana hai. This has to be R. Otherwise, it is wrong. Otherwise, it is wrong. That's the beauty of it. Okay? Yahan par lag gaya H. Yahan par lag gaya ME. Notice karo 1, 2, 3, 4. Again, it is R. So, that's the point I was trying to explain. This shift is so simultaneous and con con concerted that there will not be any kind of, a, you know, opportunity for the alkyl group to flip. If it is R, it will be R. This is a very good way to explain my point that I have tried to explain to you. This example explains that. Okay? Moving on. Let's take a screenshot. You can take a screenshot too. I hope it is clear. Okay? Moving on. Moving on. Next question. This question, listen to this. This question is very very important. Pay full attention. Because this question I will use you know, I will use the same kind of information for the JE asked question. Dhyan de na. Now examiner became quite smart. He, have, he, ha, he has given you two particular compounds, two amides they have given. Did I tell you that Wolff rearrangement is so intramolecular, within the same molecule mein hoti hai. Wolff rearrangement is so intramolecular, so simultaneous and so concerted that if opportunity milti hai for a flipping, it will not happen. And this happens within the same molecule. It will never happen out of the molecule. Hai? Inter nahi hoti. It is always intramolecular. So if there is, there is a set of two amides you are giving in the reaction mixture, you will get two primary amine, but there will not be any kind of mixing. Zara dhyan de na. This will remain, this will give you 
first one if I talk about I'm, I'm writing the answers here so first one will give you me NH2 right and to distinguish I have taken 14 isotope here and 15 isotope along with that you will get ET NH2 15 isotope yahi raega. because this rearrangement is so intramolecular there will not be any you know this R group will come only on this nitrogen this ET group will never go on this particular side wo kabhi bhi idhar attack nahi maarega aapas mein cross mixing nahi hogi that's the point very very important point JE played with this point I'll give you the question on this information theke? to distinguish between this nitrogen and this nitrogen I have used 15th isotope of nitrogen just detection ke liye kiya hai koi ghabrana mat sir kaise pata lagega just to detect ki yaar jo main soch raha hu is it the same thing happening in the reaction mixture is this reaction intramolecular if it is intramolecular et should come with this nitrogen only and it came which proved that this wolf rearrangement was so simultaneous was so intramolecular was so concerted ki aisa hi product mila i hope ye aapko samajh aa gaya ho bahut important point tha to based on this based on this je has asked the problem Based on this, JE has asked the problem. Aap log mujhe iska answer bataoge. You guys can tell me now. Dekhiye, CONH2 laga hai. Wohi hai, Wolf rearrangement ho jayegi. Br2KOH. And one time I have written NH2 with 15th isotope on this group. Would there be any kind of spillage, crossover? No, no crossover. What will be the final answer? Let me know in the comment section. Chalo, comment to nahi, mein likhi deta hoon. Premade hi ho raha hai. Thik hai, otherwise to aap se likhwata mein. To yahan pa zara dhyan de na. One compound would be a primary aromatic amine, hai na? and second compound would be nitrogen, but with what sign? 15th isotope. This is 15th isotopes, and here ME group is there. I hope you got the answer. Ye 15th isotope hai. Se likh deta hu. This is 15th isotope. There is no crossover because this reaction is so intramolecular. Aisa kuch hota hi nahi hai. Within the same molecule, ho jata hai cross wali cheez aegi hi nahi. Aasha karta hoon, ye aapko samaj aya, dikha, this is, these are the two products which we will get. Thik hai? Clear hai? Baut badiya. Toh beta, if you have loved the way this concepts or these questions were given to you and you want more from Vedantu, please join on, join in or just be a part of this crash course, right? Where we will teach, we will teach you physics, chemistry, maths, every subject would be given. We will give you questions, we will give you concepts, we will give, discuss JE problems. All these things would be happening with, you know, one-on-one -on -one interaction, right? You will learn well, you will get attention, you will get seriousness, hoga, right? So it is going to be very amazing. And yes, I have a good news for you as well. Beta, this crash course now is coming at a very less price. You can notice, it was 20,000. 7,599 का पढ़ रहा है 7,599 That is only possible if you will use my coupon code which is HMCC Buy this crash course, learn from us and be amazed ठीक है And I wish you best for your JE 2020 आप जल्दी से अप्रिल में जल्दी से crash ना करें इस crash course की <laughs> इसका objective ही है not to make you crash actually to land properly आप आराम से JE में properly land कर जाएं ठीक है तो that's it ठीक है And if you have loved the way we have taught I have taught here on this platform Please make sure, like, share and subscribe and do spread the word because I am coming here giving you lot many concepts like this. We will make a lot of videos and I am going to add a lot of concepts in the next 2 or 3 weeks. So make sure everyone gets benefit out of that. So see you next time. That's it for me today.